There was a lot of noise to, to sift through last night, so let's try and objectively look at what was said and what, what policies uh, you know, Biden actually stands by. So there's obviously con some concerning things. He, was, he, he conflicted, he, he contradicted himself multiple times about the Green New Deal, for instance. Now, let's remember, he claims to be the mod Democratic Party. Now, what he's trying to tell you is that he's the moderate that can actually, you know, like, wrangle the radicals on the Democrat Party. In reality, though, it seems that they're forming him. So on his website, it says the Green New Deal is a crucial framework uh, for solving climate change. He claims he has his own deal, but then he's also talking about reformatting four million buildings across America. This would be absurd policies. Uh, he says the Green New Deal will pay for itself. He said that last night. He said some other concerning things. He said that Antifa is just an idea, not an organization. I think a lot of people have been beaten up in the streets who have watched Antifa uh, riding around in well-organized, uniform phalanxes tearing apart cities would disagree that it's not an actual group. Uh, he wouldn't answer the question on packing the court, which I think is pretty dangerous. He talked about raising taxes, $4 trillion in new taxes, and then, and then made a very absurd claim that some unknown Wall Street firms would say that a trillion dollars in wealth would be created after he raises everybody's taxes. I, I don't know what kind of loopholes he has planned for those particular Wall Street firms, but he did say that. And, and these, these are really ridiculous claims. And they're, they're also representative of the radical left's rhetoric. So it's, it's just not true to say that he's the moderate reforming the Democrat Party.